गुड मॉर्निंग गाइज वेलकम टू माई चैनल सो वी आर हेरिंग टूवर्ड्स द फुल मून एंड दिस फुल मून सीम्स टू बी क्वाइट हेवी ड्यूटी लेट सी वट डज मार्च सेवनटीन हैव टू गिव अस टूडे मार्च सेवनटीन एनर्जीज Page of Swords, Magician, and the Ace of Wands. Okay. Okay. Firstly, what I feel is someone has done the work. A major healing cycle has been closed, or maybe I feel an alignment has happened, or an alignment has come about over here. Um. See, I feel this is one energy and this is one energy, somehow. Okay. Um. So what I'm seeing from here is that okay. Let me first talk about these two cards. Now, from these two cards, what I'm getting is that um, obviously an alignment has come about. Okay. Uh. An alignment which has led to growth. i see this is probably your the person watching i mean i see two parts to the story um this energy over here is about being the magician of your life being who you truly are and not really falling for any kind of crap that comes your way i'm also seeing that this energy now you would know if this is you or if this is someone attached to you not falling for any kind of manipulation not falling for any kind of uh bread crumbing okay i see you i feel this is your energy i see you growing as a person okay who is able to read through things uh who is able to basically uplift people also you're not alone you're not someone who's being selfish over here you're actually trying to uplift people in a lot of ways and you have help from the universe to do this i am also picking up that someone is either stalking you I'll clarify this. Somebody is talking you, keeping an eye on you, trying to see what you're up to. What is this? Hmm. I have a clarifier for page of swords, the sun and five of cups. somebody feels unhappy without you feels your absence feels the loss pretty strongly somebody is feeling this energy over here and um this could be a person attached to you for sure something happened here in this situation where 
I think there is a little bit of non-clarity still that exists. There were things that were said and done and this person doesn't feel happy about the whole thing. This person wants to break the ice I'm seeing. This person is kind of looking for an opportunity to break the ice over here somehow. To kind of come to communication or to do something, something around those lines. I also, I don't know why I felt these to be two different energies because I see two parallel stories going on. On this side, I'm seeing that there is this uh, element of growth. I see that there is no stopping over here, which I feel is your energy. You are growing, you are, uh, you are expanding, you are probably if you are doing something, a work of sorts, that is growing, okay? And... There is a new beginning in the horizon. This seems to be the magician with the ace of wands. So a lot of plans, a lot of ideas, which is leading to a new beginning. Now, I have a feeling this person wants to speak to you, this other person. Let's get some more cards. This other, and I'm very sure this is some other energy over here. Four of Wands, Three of Cups, the Death, the Star, and the Moon. Oh my God. Sun, Moon, Star, everything just seems to come out. So, I think if this was a battle about certain needs, certain demands that you had, I think you're winning this. Okay? And... I'm sorry to use words like winning, demands and, you know, losing and winning. But that's the vibe that I'm picking up from here that this person is really wanting something stable with you. Okay. There is a very deep sense of connection between the two of you and this person really wants to look at healing this connection. Okay. I'm actually seeing this fear of losing out the only source of happiness that this person could probably have so expect some communication from this person some talk or something that will make you realize or make you understand that this person has changed have they changed yeah they have they've introspected a lot this person has been very patient and I think both of you had common lessons look at this infinity symbol here and infinity symbol here you both have had common lessons between the two of you this person has deeply introspected it and understood that you're the one that they miss that they feel connected to So obviously when there are similar lessons um, that two people have, then you definitely feel a very strong sense of connect and bond with each other. And this is very normal. Okay. I do feel this person wants a fresh new okay before even commenting I would want to see what does this person want because we really see a lot of energy of wanting to reach out communicate but let's see what does this person actually want 
in this situation. Ace of Pentacles. Page of Wands. Communication. Hanged man. <laughs> King of Wands. And the Four of Cups. Okay, I feel that this person is wanting a start. Okay. But their ego is coming a little bit on the way. And they feel that you might cut them off. If they reach out, you might not reciprocate. That is what this person is thinking and feeling at this point. Okay. Um, I don't see that. This person wants to come forward. I think they might give you some subtle signs or some hints here and there. But will they do something? Because it's giving me mixed signals. Because this person thinks and then get, goes back. Will they do something? Nine of Swords. I don't think so. The Tower. The Hierophant. Five of Pentacles and the Ace of Cups. Okay. So I feel that this person is really scared to lose out on their respect. Like maybe you might do something or say something which will really break them into pieces. And I think this person is also going through a phase in their life which is quite taxing for them currently. Quite taxing for them. So I have a feeling that they might give some subtle hints, but I don't see them fully coming forward and saying anything to you. Nothing of that sort is happening here. So let's see what is the advice for you in this situation. for you queen of pentacles nine of pentacles six of pentacles six of swords why are the cards confusing me the star okay right now is not the time for you to actually focus on this situation this person's energy is coming. I think this person is kind of focused on you or maybe they think land up thinking about you. That energy exists. But the whole point over here is that you got to go on with your journey of understanding yourself, being there for yourself and building yourself. I feel there's a lot, lot of heart chakra healing that needs to happen. Um, and after that, I feel that your life will become totally different here the star so major energies what i pick up from here is that your wisdom or your life is growing as in i'm not sure if this person will, will be able to match up to your growth and that's what is kind of bothering this person i think maybe they just know or feel it energetically that you know you are becoming a better version of who you are By the end of another six weeks, you would know whether to stay in this situation or any situation. You would know that whether this is worth your time and effort or not. You will get that answer. Okay. So till then, I'm not seeing that there is any advice that you should give them a subtle hint or a sign or try to talk to them. No. Just be your own thing. That's all. Because I see this person has a lot of ego issues where this person doesn't want something stable what they want is ace of pentacles and page of wands and then there's hanged men so basically they they want something stable but the way this person comes across could be a little flirtatious and looks unstable okay so the energy that i pick up is a little bit of a egotistic person who's who cannot take no as an answer so yes, these are things that this person has. Alright, so that is what I have for you. 
Okay guys, private readings are open so you can reach out. Let me know in the comments if this reading resonated. Alright, take care and I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.